What is going on YouTube? Good call six here. Uh, back to show you some cards. I uh, haven't had anything come in the mail. Uh, I don't have anything coming from eBay uh, currently. Uh, and I was just bored and wanted to make a video. I was originally going to do a uh, <clears throat> Jameis Winston PC showcase. Uh, but then I remembered I sent off uh, one of those cards to get re-encapsulated to BGS. So who knows when that will be coming back. So once that does come back, I'll, I'll do a Jameis PC showcase. Uh, but in the meantime, I uh, figured to make a video and kind of wanted to show off a little bit of, or actually the whole thing of, of my uh, baseball PC. Uh, as you guys know, I don't really do much baseball. Uh, there's a few players that I like and try to collect. I kind of want to build the baseball PC up a little bit. So um, it's probably like 20 cards a show in total. Um, first few are nothing crazy. And then towards the end are a few of my favorites. So um Hope you guys like this so yeah we'll get started uh, my only attempt ever actually i bought a few cards but at uh prospecting didn't go too well andrew church base and two more andrew church bases um got an andrew church refractor and got a 500 or not numbered uh andrew church blue i like the blue because it just goes with the mets so um, and then the last Andrew Church is a Blue Wave. Always love the Blue Wave cards. That one's numbered 250. So, um, this guy would have done anything. I guess I could have made a little bit of profit, maybe. Uh, if not, I got a stack of uh, $10 right there. So, uh, uh, on to a few Brett Boone cards. Uh, as you guys know, he's one of my favorite baseball players. Named my dog after him. So, uh, this is out of, I think, Museum. Pretty sure, yeah, it's museum. Uh, nice on card autograph, numbered one out of two ninety nine. Uh, I was pretty excited when Top started making Brett Boone cards. That was last year. I haven't seen any yet out of this year's stuff. I was hoping they would have made a dynasty of them, but probably not a big enough name to be in it. So uh, this is the Bowman Chrome uh, rookie flashback autograph on card. It's kind of nice about all these; they're all on card. I think this is out of tier one, numbered to two ninety nine. Another tier one out of two ninety nine. This is out of two thousand four sweet spot. Nice one. I haven't seen many of those pop up. I have a safe search of Brett Boone autographs. Like I said they don't pop up much because he really doesn't have much. Uh, and some of the stuff really just doesn't catch my eye enough to bid on or buy. So um, now on to a uh, penis on a skateboard. Craig Biggio, Hall of Fame autograph. As you know, I like my high techs. I think this is the title to 50. It's always a big Craig Biggio fan. Uh, I love all the, the old Astros. Biggio, Bagwell, Jeff Kent, Roger Clemens. I really like uh, watching that team play back in the day. So, um, Next up out of the Mint. One of the more recent pickups. Jacob DeGrom on card autograph. Number to 50. This guy's killing it. Uh, Yoena Cespedes. Wish he had more Mets stuff out there. But what can you do? On card number to 50. <clears throat> Hopefully my voice doesn't go out. Uh, this was a gift and a care package for, I believe it was a Christmas present uh, from 2-4 Nathan Oak. Nice shine to this one. Had a Topps Tribute. David Wright dual bat autograph. Created a BGS 9510 with all 9.5s. Number 299. <clears throat> so that's a really, really nice card. Um, one of my favorites. These are, I mean, it's t tough to pick up one of my favorite baseball cards because I have so many nice ones that I like. Uh, I just like this one just because it's an inscription. Uh, this is uh, Thor, Noah Syndergaard, number 99. Wish he had the long hair like he does now, but this is probably. Yeah, this most definitely was his rookie year, or before that. So, um, those actually sell quite well now. Um, this was from Dave, Josh Johnson, fifty-five, in a Christmas package. Love the look of this card. It's got the rainbow foliage. Uh, David Wright out of Tops Five Star, number twenty-eight or two out of twenty-five. Nice, nice looking card there. One of my favorites too. 
Uh, now on to some Dynasty. Uh, as you can tell, I said before, I like Craig Biggio. Uh, this is out of 14 Dynasty. 15 Tops Dynasty. Uh, the green version, I guess, numbered one out of five. Nice three color patch. Can't really tell, but it's like beigeish white, then white, and then navy. So, uh, another dynasty, the Rocket, Roger Clemens. Always wanted an autograph of him in an Astros uni. Uh, this one's got a pretty nice patch on it, numbered one out of ten. The one thing that I actually don't like is what Topps does with these next card. Uh, this is out of Topps Dynasty, also. Um, David Wright. Numbered out of 10. I don't like that they do like a rookie premiere photo shoot with some of these cards. Um, Noah Syndergaard, I think this is third year cards. Every year they have two or three of the same exact shot of him just staring at the camera. Um, it's like get a little bit more creative. I mean, you can probably get him in. You, action shots shouldn't be too tough. They play 162 games. I mean... What's he, he probably pitches in about 30 or 40 of them. So um, shouldn't be too tough to get an action shot. So you have to use these stupid little photo shoot pictures. That's what I try to avoid when I pick up uh, baseball cards is, is those photo shoots. But I won that one in a raffle for like 8 bucks, So can't complain too much on that. Um, now on to the last five cards. Uh, this is one of my more recent pickups. Uh, this is out of Topps 5 Star. Love this design. Love, love, love it. Uh, Cal Ripken, always want an autograph of him, and I want to pick up a Dynasty autograph of him too, but they're a little pricey, so I might have to save up for that. Uh, that's out of 2015 Five Star. This would be an awesome set to put down, put together down the road. Um, next up, another Brett Boone, but this one's a pretty nice one. Uh, this is out of Tops Tier One, gold ink on card autograph. Numbered right there by my thumb, uh, 101. So, not many Brett Boone 101s. Glad to have one of them in my collection. Uh, this is probably one of my fa first baseball pickups. Always wanted an autograph of this guy. Probably my all time favorite player, uh, growing up especially, but now also. Uh, this is out of Tops 5 Star. Guess I like 5 Star. Uh, Ken Griffey Jr. Silver ink autograph on card, number to 99. Just really love the pose on this one. The throwback, old school gold chain. Just a win-win in my book on this card. So, it will always be one of my favorites. Uh, my favorite David Wright in the collection and probably one of my top cards that I like in my collection. Always loved high tech and always love these, uh, the red orbits. Refractors. Yeah, you can tell. It's got a lot of nice shine to it. Uh, the red just pops along with the, the shinage. So. Um, and this one's numbered out of... You might not be able to see it, but 10. So I really don't like what they did with the high tech uh, nowadays. They got like an orange title and then a, the, I don't, they're like the 25... I just don't know why they got to change stuff. Just can't keep it the way they, they originally did it to make people like it. So, um, And lastly, this is probably my favorite card in my little baseball collection. Uh, this guy was also one of my favorites growing up. And you know I love these cards. So I had to pick one up, especially at him. Uh, this is Jeff Bagwell at a Topps Museum. Silver ink. And this is the uh, black. Uh, black frame parallel. You can see the rainbow foliage on it. Numbered out of five. So, probably at the moment right now, this is my favorite card in the baseball collection. So, there you have it. Hope everyone's doing well. Uh, like I said, nothing coming in. There's a few things I have my eye on, so maybe we'll have a pickup video here in a week or so. Um, other than that, Hope you guys have a great Easter. I'm um, just hanging out tomorrow with the family. Uh, do a little brunch and then probably go golf in the afternoon. So other than that, guys, hope you liked it. I'll see you later. Bye.